So hi everyone, my name is Nicole Hurwitz. I'm currently an employer relations assistant at the Stony Brook University Career Center. And today I'm joined with Emma Peck from Broadridge Financial Solutions. Hi, Emma. Hi, how are you, Nicole? Thank you so much for having me today. Of course, thank you for joining me. So I'd love for you to further introduce yourself as well as your role at the company. Great. So again, my name is Emma Peck. I lead early career recruiting at Broadridge, so all of our campus recruiting efforts. So what that means for us is that I recruit for all of the roles that require zero to two years experience, as well as manage and recruit for our intern program and our rotational programs, which are for East, um, early career graduates. So, you know, and that can kind of lead us right into the roles that we do have available. So this year at Broadridge, we are recruiting, of course, for our intern program. Um, we have roles available on all sides of the business, as well as our rotational program roles for folks that are recent grads. And then outside of that, we do have a variety of different roles for maybe any alumni or folks that are graduating in December um, in finance and especially technology. Wonderful. Thank you so much for providing that information and insight, Emma. And so I'll dive right into our next question, and that is, what does diversity and inclusion look like at Broadridge? Yeah, no, that's a great question. So I think for us, you know, diversity and inclusion is, of course, it's, you know, we try and have it ingrained in everything that we do. For me personally, um, on talent acquisition, you know, what that means for me is, of course, you know, trying to recruit top diverse talent and making sure that I'm presenting a diverse slate of candidates for all of our roles. And also working with our interviewers to make sure that we have um, diverse associates represented on our interview panels as well. So we can really show it on both sides of the table. Um, it also really means for us, you know, um, really supporting our affinity networks at Broaders. We have a great multicultural association network. So it's making sure that all of our associates, you know, feel represented and that our multicultural network has all the resources that they need um, to provide, you know, different, you know, professional development groups, you know, networking events and so forth. And also providing that same support for our women's leadership forum, as well as the Broadridge Be Pride Network. Wonderful. Thank you so much. And so I know you spoke a little bit about what diversity means to you in talent acquisition, but as a whole, as a company, you know, why is diversity important to Broadridge Financial Solutions? Yeah, um, diversity is it's so important because, you know, it really helps broader to expand and it helps really expand our network in terms of opening us up to new ideas, you know, and making sure that we are bringing people from all walks of life to the table that can bring in their own personal experiences. Um, and then that can kind of reflect on the work that we do. So I really think it betters our organization from the bottom up, um, especially being, you know, an early career recruiter. It's important for me to build up diversity at that entry level because at Broadridge, we really want people to stay with us long term. You know, we want people to come to Broadridge for a career, not just a job. So it's really important if we want to see diversity um, at a leadership level, we have to have that diversity reflected um, in our entry level roles as well in order to make that happen all across the board. Wonderful. That's so great to hear. And I know you had already touched upon this a little bit, but if you can explore a little bit deeper, you know, what are those specific diversity initiatives that Broadridge has taken so far, whether it be resource groups, task forces, or different workshops? Yeah, so, you know, Broadridge has committed to ensuring that all of our diverse, you know, our interviewers, we have diversity represented there. They've also offended to me, uh, you know, committed, excuse me, to making a certain amount of hires, you know, in diversity groups. We've also recently hired a new DEI program director to support our chief diversity officer. And we have also recently, you know, formed a committee of internal associates that will work with our chief um, diversity officer in keeping Broadridge on task with all of our goals. So it's been really exciting. You know, last year um, we hired a chief diversity officer. That was the first time we've had that role um, at Broadridge. So it's now, you know, exciting to see that area expand and really become kind of its own department. Because again, I think they will really be able to help, you know, guide Broadridge as a firm. Wonderful. That's so great to hear as well. Love the change, love the different initiatives. And so that kind of leads me into my next question. And final question is, why has Broadridge chosen Stony Brook as a place to uh, address your diversity initiatives and recruitment? Yeah, 
Well, you know, Broad Edge chooses Stony Brook, I think, for all of our recruiting needs. You know, um, Broad, Stony Brook is a great source of top talent, you know, um, and especially top diverse talent. Personally, I've been recruiting at Stony Brook for many years. It is absolutely, you know, one of my favorite places to go to. Um, I really appreciate that Stony Brook has really been ahead of the curve. You know, they've been having, you know, these diversity careers. They've had, you know, the DPLN program for the past few years, not really just in the past year when everyone else is thinking about it. Stony Brook was already there. They were already committed to these efforts, you know, and I think that they've really proven that and they have been dedicated to, you know, diverse recruiting for a long time, you know, which is, I think, really great. And all of the, you know, career services team, I think is so fantastic. So I think it's a great place to go, you know, for all recruiting. Wonderful. Thank you so much for that. And of course, you know, that kind of wraps up my questions. But overall, we are so very excited to have Broadridge and yourself attend the upcoming diversity fair on this Friday from 2 to 4 p.m. And overall, thank you so much for your time and insight. Emma, I really appreciate it. Absolutely. Anytime. We are excited for Friday's event as well. And thank you so much, Nicole.